in the Temple of Ascension once again, we will be going to do our third fight, which is going to be against Alderid and Mirnin, or Mirnur. We're going to go ahead and we're going to choose them. For this, we are going to take an ability here. We're going to choose Pelicos here. And what we're going to choose is the Spear. So we're going to take the Deep Echo Trident. I take it. Go somewhere? So once, so in this fight, what we're going to make sure to be doing is we're going to be fighting the one that comes into melee range. I believe that is Ar Arduran. And the reason for that is is he's going to do the most damage output. He does a da attack that allows for him to use an Anima Seed, which we want to make sure we stop using the Spear. So that way he cannot use that on us. The other thing is he'll do a small mitigatable damage. The other one will stay at a range, shooting a bow, which we can line of sight behind the thing. The thing is, is that the arrows will pass through the statues, so we want to make sure to be moving around as much as possible. And we'll be using our nuke to kind of hit, to make sure we hit both of them. We want to make sure we hit both. So as you can see, she's got the bow there for Alderin, and we want to make sure to avoid all their abilities here, including the whirling dervishes that he does, the mana dervishes. <coughs> Kind of got sloppy here. Players who are threads of fate that choose from the narrative campaign and how to some random skip the That's good. Not for people with campaign this level. And there you go. It was a little bit on the sloppy side, but we managed to achieve what we wanted to do there. No, you fight the mobs and you click on it and it slowly 